The origins of this boat go back to the late 19th, early 20th century. My thoughts are always with the, the grand uh, racing yachts uh, uh, around the turn of the century. They were something else, those boats. They were absolutely, oh, achingly beautiful. We're looking to the past for our uh, creative inspiration in, in terms of the, uh, the aesthetics, the style, the ambience of the boat. But we are combining this with modern solar technology, with uh, modern uh, brushless electric motors, lithium ion batteries, uh, electronic controllers. So in other words, you've got something which looks and feels like it's 100 or more years ago, but in fact it is bang up to date in its underpinnings. The solar panels are putting in energy into a battery bank and the motors are then taking the power out of that to drive the boat. Now that will drive the boat at about three and a half knots. Technically, you could run all day just on solar. You can use this boat day after day after day with no fuel costs at all. The noise factor, it's almost completely silent. So you hear the sound of the water, so you can hear the sound of the seabird. It's an entirely different experience. This boat in particular was designed as a commercial ferry. It also, in the back of my mind, I thought, right, how about the private sector? How about families? The toilet is big enough to change it. In the centre of the boat, there's various options for tables, so we've got a dining experience too. This has to be the future, it really does. In years to come, my grandchildren can, can say that uh, my granddad built these boats and he was a man that really cared about the environment and he was a man that, that put his money where, it, where his mouth was. He was somebody that, that um, really tried hard to make a difference in this world and to leave something good and lasting um, for future generations.